Hello and welcome to my Ultima 4 playthrough. We are here just outside the town of Scarabray, which we uh, reached last time, and we still have some exploring to do there. So uh, let us uh, waste no time and dive on in. I do want to show you the stats. I did a little bit of a little bit of um, work off camera, just some of the boring stuff. You'll see that my experience is at 845, so that should take me up to level five. So we need to get back to uh, Lord British so I can get that. I think that'll give me 500 hit points, so that would be handy. Uh, Iolo's got a little ways to go yet, and um, so does Julia have a ways to go to before they can get a level up. Nothing's really changed there. Um, nothing's really changed there, but we do have the runes of compassion, justice, and spirituality, because we found that last one here. Actually, no, S can't be spirituality, right? Because the rune of spirituality, do we have that rune? No, that's for sacrifice. That's for sacrifice, sorry. Um, because the rune of spirituality is in, uh, the treasure room of Britannia, which I'm assuming is at Lord British's castle. So we have a couple of reasons to go back to Lord British's castle. Um, we've got reagents still. And I, what I did off camera is I spent quite a bit of time, uh, mixing for spells. So we've now have 10 cure spells. We've got 15 fireball. We've got 10 heal spells, and I think the rest of them are pretty much all the same. We got six light, five opens, two protection, two quickness, two sleep, uh, two exit, which will be handy when we get into dungeons. And then, of course, one blink spell there at the beginning. And uh, I think we've got enough uh, stuff to make uh, a few more fireballs and, and cure spells and whatnot um, if we need to. So we're in pretty good shape. But our main thing that we need to do here is is finish exploring this town and hopefully find a companion because we have not yet done that yet. Now, one thing I want to do is talk to Mr. Onk here again because um, he had a tip for us about the shrine. Oh, I thought you, thought you had a tip about the shrine. Maybe we have to go, I keep the secret of the rune. Not Rube, that might be me. <laughs> mantra, the mantra is is Om. Search for the rune of spirituality in the treasure chamber of Batania. Yet we knew that. Hast thou found the shrine? Nope, not yet. Enter the gate of full moons. Yeah, I wanted to see exactly what that said. So the, the gate with a destination of full moon is, is the gate is at Minoc. In fact, let me bring the map up. So we're at Scarabray just to the kind of in the, in the, uh, on the Western edge, um, right in the middle there from a North South perspective. And if you look at Minoc, which is kind of, um, at the very Northern edge near the middle, a little bit to the Western side, you see Minoc and its moon gate is the full moon. And so what I'm wondering if we need to do here, I was thinking about this after our, our episode, is is go there and then look for a gate with the two full moons, which I'm not quite sure what that's going to do for us. I think it's going to take us someplace kind of otherworldly. I don't know. That's my best guess as to what this means, because right now, the, the you know, the left moon is where you're at. The right moon is where you're going. So we can't. You know, technically speaking, you can't go to yourself, in theory. I don't know. Maybe there's a whole other world we're going to find out. Let's uh, see if you have anything to tell us about the gate. Can't help us about the gate. Uh, moon. Moons. Full. All right. Well, I think that's that. Okay, so let's... I'm, oh, I'm trying to go north. I want to go north. Hit the right button, Keith. All right, so we did not look in this area. So we had the inn, and we've got this guy here. we got a couple of guys here, and then we've got um, food for thought. I did buy some food, you may notice as well. You know, our gold is really low because we were getting down on, on food. And if I say yes, we don't need any right now, so I'll say no. That's all I can do with you. Okay. Let's talk to this person here. He says... I am Santayana, 
Interesting. A tall ranger. Well, what is your job besides having a really long name? I carry the light within my heart. The light of philosophy. Oh. Uh, I really didn't want to have to type in philosophy, but I guess I have to type in philosophy. I got to just check. Okay, did I do it? In philosophical minds, the familiar excites wonder. In philosophical minds, the familiar excites wonder. Okay. Dost thou always tread the right path? Well, I guess I'll be honest and say no, because half our stats suck. Few can but strive to do so okay he cannot join me all right let's talk to this person whoops that wasn't what i wanted to do a skilled ranger Ooh, baby what's your name i am michelangelo excellent what's your job i'm assuming it's not painted since you painting since you are a skilled ranger i strive along the path art thou far along the path am i far along the path i'm gonna say no for not thou shalt be <sighs> okay he can't join me oh golly all right. Is there anybody? If I talk to this guy, he just wants to sell me a room. Welcome to the Inn of the Spirits. Spirits. I am Tyrone. Are you in need of lodging? Let's see. Unfortunately, I've only got one very small room. One bed. Worse, it is haunted. If you wish to stay, it costs five gold pieces. Take it. Why not? Maybe we'll meet the ghost. Let's see what happens. We don't really need to sleep because I did sleep, but all right, we didn't meet the ghost. <laughs> Is there anything to find in here? I was hoping we meet the ghost. So we do one more just for Chucks. It's five gold pieces. Uh, I don't know how the three of us are fitting in this room, but you know. Whatever. Okay, so ghost, ghost. There's no secret passage in this room. Okay. So we slept. I forget where it was we slept before, where we couldn't get through the night without some brigands taking us over. But here we are in a room that is haunted, and we can't get haunted. Can't go that way. Yeah, and I searched everything else. All right. I don't really understand what the point of that was. All right, so let's see. So there's no secret rooms off of here that I can that I can see. We talked to that guy last time. Talked to that guy last time. We talked to the child last time. Yeah, as soon as I go that far, then we are. All right, so what's down here? The mystic healer. We don't need healing. Oh, I can give 100 points. I, I will do that because that will help my compassion. All right. All right. Uh, no, no, no. That's not what I wanted to do. All right. So I can't talk to him about rumors or anything. What's this up here? Herbs. I talked to this guy. Presto. Join. He cannot join me. All right. I'm pretty sure that there's supposed to be a companion here. It's got to be one of those rangers. It's got to be. So let's uh, let's go back and talk to them. Michelangelo, nope. So these guys were both the guys and they couldn't. 
Who are you? White. I know I talked to you. Did I talk to you? Miter. Job. I'm pretty sure I talked to this person. Yeah, the journal. It tells the white stone. Yeah, we 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 went through all that with her. Okay. All right. There's somebody we missed. It wasn't the boy because we can't take a child with us. Um. Solemn Ranger name. Shamino. Job. Seek the inner light. Light. I seek the one great truth. That which lies within the codex. Okay. Oh, there we go. There we go. We've got Shamino joining us. So let's look at his stats. I knew we had one here. There had to be one here. So he is a ranger. He has got a sword. And he is got leather. So he's, he's got eh, moderate magic, I think. Julia, he's got a little bit more strength, a little bit less dexterity than Julia. He's a little bit more intelligent than Julia. He's got 150 experience. Okay. I think we've done everything here that we need to do. I think uh, we are all stocked up on things. And uh, let's see. So there's really nothing to see on that island, it doesn't look like. Yep, that island's just pretty much empty. There's supposed to be another one off to the northeast there, according to the map. But uh, we can't see it. And this is the mainland down here. Oh, uh, no. I don't really want to fight these guys, but I may have to. Scarabray is the... Which quarter is it? I think it's it's the last quarter, which means the white half is on the is on the right side. So we need that for the leftmost moon. And then if we wanted to go, uh, maybe maybe back to Lord British. We got a couple of reasons to go back to Lord British, um, and that would be the um, crescent on the left side. So let's see what we can see here. If we can uh, wait for that combination to come up. All right, I messed that up. I messed that up. Where are we? <laughs> I'm not where I thought we were going to be. Oh, we're back in Yalom. Oh, dear. It must have shifted just at the last second. Gosh darn it. All right. I'm going to wait and see if I can get the right combination because Yalom is first quarter, I think. But yeah, Yalom's first quarter. So let's see if I can get the same uh, combination here. It may take a few rotations. Okay, so we don't seem to be able to get there from there. This is Magencia. Hmm. We were here before, and I got freaked out. Well, first of all, we didn't have enough cure spells if we needed them. And second of all, there was a, like a demon here. And I was afraid that we were going to be in trouble with the demon. But I'm not sure that it's going to um, attack us. So let's we're here. Let's check it out. Let's check it out. Hey, we managed to not get. You meet a horrible, ghastly devil. He says, I am Virtue Bane. All right. That's a horrid, horrid name. What's your job? <laughs> I welcome thee to Magencia, proud city of the high seas. Ain't looking too proud to me, buddy. Uh, welcome. Welcome. Is there a nice welcome bag? Okay. Um, city? Seas? 
Pisces. Okay. Um, name, job, health, devilish. <laughs> Hilarious. So, job, your job is to welcome me to Magencia. If I say Magencia, okay, here we go. Magencia fell into unto the realm of darkness for the foundation of their virtue was ill placed in pride. Interesting that the demon is saying it's ill placed in pride. Art thou proud? Well, I'm going to say no. I don't think I'm proud. Ah, he's he's upset. <laughs> All right. Uh, we have ghosts. Once again, maybe somebody we can talk to. I am ghostly, a shadowy ghost. What is it you do here? I haunt Magentia. Okay, I don't know if we've got a a like rune that's supposed to be here or a mantra. I don't think we I don't think there is. I don't think there is. I'm trying to find my list of mantras here. Yeah, I don't think there is. Cause we already got the rune, the like the mantra of humility, and we got that someplace else. All right. So I don't think there's anything like that that we can get here. So let's just continue Snakey Snake. Now, talking about Snakey Snakes, I don't know if he's going to attack me here. Maybe he will. Let's see if I can talk to the Snakey Snake. You meet a mean-looking viper. What's your name, mean-looking viper? I am Date. <laughs> That's what I call a mean-looking viper. What is it you do here? I bring death to all life in Magencia. Hmm. Uh, life. All right. So he's going to attack me. We are going to back away. And the reason I'm backing away is, oh, 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 oh. Okay. Julia's poisoned. God darn it. I got to cast a cure on Julia. And the reason for that is, is you, is one of the things that, you know, I remember my justice score was so low. Um, one of the things we're supposed to do is not kill non-evil creatures. And that's things like snakes and bugs and anything that we might consider natural in our world, like you know, horses or whatnot. Uh, we haven't run across horses yet. Oh my gosh, we can buy weapons here. I am Haywood. Uh, okay, what's your job? So anyway, so it, we aren't supposed to kill those. So like we're not supposed to kill snakes and, and that. Now, stuff like orcs and cyclops and headless and things like that, they are evil creatures. We can just pound on their buttocks all we want. But if we come across something that's a natural creature, we're not supposed to. All right, Haywood, haunt eternally. Well, he's got... Job security, I guess. Pride goeth before, shame cometh after. Art thou proud? I'm going to stick with my no. A proud soul surely knows not its worth. Interesting. Okay. So this is like a cautionary tale. Now, can we actually buy weapons? No, I can't talk to this guy. Interesting. That's kind of strange. All right. So let's go down here. Yeah, I'm guessing there's not going to be a, a a companion here. A small ghost. Oh, of a child? That's sad. I am Casperin. <laughs> uh, you must be friendly. To hunt this shop. Armor, huh? A lot of haunting goes on around here. Know thee why? Um, well, I do because you felt a pride. So I'll say yes. Pride is the surest measure of goals never attained. Oh, that's interesting. Now you're making me, now you're making me question my life goals here that I haven't gotten done. We got skellies down there. So I could kill skellies. Now they can pass through walls. I am ghostly. 
I, ha I think that's the same guy. So either that or we have multiple ghostly. Shadowy ghost. What's your name? I am ghostly. I haunt Magentia. Okay, haunt. Okay. So yeah, we've got... How is it a ghost can go through... Can go through a... Um, and we got lots of skellies in here. I don't know if they're going to attack me. They don't seem to be attacky tacky. Skinny skeleton. Name. I am slim. Makes sense. Job. I rattle my bones. I did value myself far too greatly. That pride was my downfall. Art thou always humble? Well, I'm not going to say always. Take no pride in humility, lest ye destroy it. There we go. So hopefully I help my <laughs> honesty score there a little bit. Pride, a terrible thing. Humility, can't help with that. Okay, so that was interesting. So I think that was good. Let's talk to this skelly. A weeping skeleton named Splot. Oh, What's your job here? I regret, hence the weeping. I was proud, strip thyself of conceits, only the humble are pure. Conceits or just conceits, that's right. Proud, humble. The root from which all virtues grow. Interesting. Dost thou seek purity? I do seek it. I do seek it, yes. Then ask the snake of the rune and stone. Oh, crap. <laughs> ah. we, we, we need a rune and stone. We had to ask the snake. The snake that attacked us and then disappeared oh no golly okay maybe there's another snake here all right oh dear uh talk to you ghostly job huh okay yeah we've We've talked to you before, of course. All right, cast spell me. We're going to cast cure for Shamino. There we go. Let's talk to this guy. I thought I was talking. Oh, I did. No. A shadowy ghost. I thought I was talking to that skelly. Where are you going, dude? Okay, job, haunt. You're you're a skelly though, dude. You seem to be having a seem to be having a bit of a identity crisis. All right, let's go up here. Here we are in the pub. I meet a dumpy ghost. Okay, what's your name, dumpy ghost? I am Boozer. Makes sense why you're hanging in the pub. What do you do? I was once a powerful merchant. But now you're a skelly that thinks he's this ghost. My wealth was boundless. I held great power. You want to, like, point me to your wealth? Uh, power. A proud soul surely knows not its worth. Dost thou see? Yeah, I can understand that. The world goes on without me. That's true. Okay. That's what sucks. I meet a jabbering skeleton. He says, I am Skullface. Descriptive name. I am a nobleman of great birth. Nobleman. Me and my brother are the last two of the great merited family. Thou hast heard of us, of course, yes? Uh, no, I'm going to say not, because I'm guessing you're both here. 
you must not be from near these parts. Okay. That's not wrong. All right, let's go up and talk to this ghost. Shadowy ghost name, if I can type. Ghostly, yeah, all right. We've, we've talked to, go we've talked to a, a few ghostlies and I don't think we need to talk to ghostlies anymore. All uh, right then, let's keep looking around here. Here was food. We're gonna have to go back up and look for the snake. A fat skeleton. What's your name? I don't know how a skeleton gets fat. I guess it's thick bones. Bulbous. What is it you do here? I run this shop. Why the food shop? Of course. It looks like a food shop to me, but can I interest thee in some rations? If I say yes, <laughs> our stock seems to have spoiled. <laughs> That's funny. All right. Armor up there. Did I already go to the armory? I kind of want to go down there, but then we're we're probably all going to get. I guess we're just going to have to deal with it. Deal with it. Get in my way. Oh gosh. All right. Um. This place is going to make me go through my cure spells and like no time flat. I'm going to go as long as I can, I guess. And then I got, would have to either heal or I would have to do the cure. So I might as well just do the, just do the cure. All right. Yeah, we were down there in the armory already. Let's go up here. I don't want anybody to die because that's expensive as all heck. All right. Let's... What, what I don't like about this is we still have... Can we get out of here? Before, without anybody dialing, dying? Because we have one, at least one thing of... poison we have to go across there. I'd hate to cure them just to have to heal them. Alright, so here we go. <sighs> Except we're going to have to come back in anyway because I want to see if I can find that snake. And so what I think I want to do is I want to leave Magentia and then come back in and see if the snake responds. Alright, well, I'm just going to do it. Uh, two... And then maybe what we'll do when we're outside is we'll hold up in camp and try to get some of the health back. For everybody. That way, if they do get poisoned again. You know, at least they'll have enough health to deal with it. Alright, so let's hold up and camp. Hopefully nothing's going to attack us. Okay, so I think Shemino is still 50, down 50. I think we can live with that to start with. Okay, so let's... Maybe we'll luck out. We, we lucked out here before. Oh, and we lucked out again. Okay, so let's see if we can find a... Oh, there is a snake. Yay! Okay, rune. The sacred rune of humility was banished from this city. Ask Baron in pause. I think we already got that. Did we? Did we already get that? Um, no, I guess not. I'm looking at the wrong thing. Uh,
Okay. So I don't think we had that before. Um, so we need to now ask about the stone of Mr. Sneaky Sneaky here. Those who seek the black stone need to ask at the pub in Britain. Interesting. All right. Um, can you tell us anything about the shrine? He cannot help us with that. All right, and he's gonna attack us again. And of course, he's gonna he's gonna. All right, I think we're done here, Magencia. Okay, good. Nobody else got poisoned. All right, cast one, cure one. All right, so actually let's look and see. How many cure spells I have left? Four, Ugh. okay. Uh, we're gonna hold up in camp. Hold up and camp again. Hopefully we can get everybody to closer to full health. Shamino should get up there. I should get closer. Um, assuming we're not attacked. One thing I like about these small islands is that they don't seem to um, attack you. There doesn't be anything to attack you on these small islands. Like there's not enough space for, for things to spawn other than maybe in the water nearby. Okay, so let's try for Lord British's castle. We're at Magentia... Magentia is uh, the crescent waning, so it's the crescent um, on the right, and then New British's cat, Lord British's castle is a crescent on the left, so we want right and left. So it should be the two crescents kind of up next to each other there in the middle. Hopefully, we'll see. Okay, so here we are. We've come through. Um, it doesn't seem to be able to take us directly to Lord British's castle. If I bring up the map briefly, uh, we are at that moon gate that is south of the Fens of the Dead and north of the Cape of Heroes. They're kind of in the uh, central southern portion of the map. So I think what we'll do is we will try to journey north here and... Um, we might as well hit Trinzic because Trinzic is just to the north there. Uh, that's the last town we have to go through. So we can visit there and maybe pick up our last, our last uh, bad person, our, our last companion. Okay, so Iolo. See, what we really need to do is we need to get, I'm going to leave Iolo there. Um, we aren't lined up with anybody, but what I'm thinking of doing is giving, um, okay, that rogue is fleeing, is giving Julia back her mace. I didn't need to do that. Um, and then they can be in the front and they can, I'm not sure if that's the one that's fleeing or not. And then they can be in the front and they can be that guy's lightly wounded. And they can be pounding on him, and then Iolo and I can be in the back um, with our slings, and daggers, and other ranged weapons. Uh, let's take care of this guy here that's trying to... Heavily wounded... And Julie just is not very good with the sling. She misses a lot. That's probably due to her dexterity score, I'm guessing. Okay, so that guy's fleeing. That guy's fleeing. 
That guy's dead. Okay, so one fled. I am not at all certain which one's fleeing <laughs> at this point and which one's not. Uh, I'm going to wait. Move Viola over, move her up, move him up. All right. Lightly wounded. Ready. Mace. So I'm, you know, with the sword. That guy's fleeing now. Iolo. Uh, I guess I'll bring him and line him up. Julia's got her mace. So having her there isn't really helping. I think we just got the guy in front of me. It's the only one at this point not fleeing. Oh, he was fleeing. Darn it. All right. I think everybody else at this point is running away. So we'll let them run away. But we're not going to leave the field ourselves so we don't get a hit on our Valor. All right. Get Iolo. 94 gold. Okay. So if we come in here and ta-da, this should be Trinsic. And here we are, intrinsic. It was almost like I intended to be here. But I'm actually uh, at my time limit, I think, for this one. So uh, I'm going to stop this here. We will investigate Trinsic next time. I hope you come back for the next one. So thank you for watching. And until then, be seeing you.